<laughs> Man, it's been a hot minute since we touched this game. I mean, it's completely fair since we just finished Mario Kart. It's the next logical step, okay? Stop looking at me like that. I mean, it's been a while since we played this game. After all, I really need to get back into this game. I've been playing it off camera for a while now. And just to let you know, things have changed since the first video. With that said, our first character today is none other than my boy Figment. He's back and he's bigger than ever. And you want to know why? Because if you remember from last time, we've gone from no wrenches to no shades. Seriously? Okay. Today, we're going to be featuring some new characters as well as some older characters or whatever from p uh, past seasons. And I'll get into that um, later. But for now... I think we're just gonna go and take our boy Figment for a test drive because by God, I deserve it. And Figment does too. Okay, maybe not. I'm, I'm kind of going for a very clean race right now, but as you can see, these guys are not making it any easier. See? It's absolute madness in here now. Even if I'm using Figment or anybody else, it's... Let's just say things since last time have definitely changed to the point where it's gotten much harder. And that is a tiger. You do not want to touch... Okay. I didn't see the other one. What the hell? <laughs> I guess I shouldn't have overlooked the fact that there were two Jasmines in the room. And again, I'll go into that later, but for now... Let's suffer together. A few minutes later. I am in seventh right now. And there's nobody else behind me. What the hell? A little longer than a few minutes later. Yep, still in seventh. Don't know what else I can do back here. But, okay. Eventually. I guess I need to go faster. I think we have to. See, this is what I have to deal with now with Figment. You thought the wrenches from the previous video were bad? Right now, it's me trying to get much further up with Figment. Right now, it's just a big tug of war. And we're already halfway through this segment or whatever. I have no idea. Stop looking at me like that. This is gonna be a rough video, isn't it? Uh-oh. I think we've got ourselves a doppelganger. Two Figments in the room. This is gonna end well, isn't it? No, apparently not. What the hell? There was no countdown. There was no warning. That's the other thing about this game. <laughs> Let's, can we back that up for a second? I don't know what it is about this game, but something about ranked just hits way different. Like, to the point where, with absolutely no warning, the game just starts. Like this. Please send help. I don't like it. <laughs> Go for the train. The other thing I need to know about just absolutely no warning to the start of the race is that whenever it happens, the room goes deadly silent. No music, nothing. It feels like we're in a horror movie that only Walt Disney himself would be afraid of. Okay, we're doing pretty good. We're in fourth right now. As long as nothing happens, we should be fine. A few inches later. Uh, Can I try again? Not today, Figment, but maybe next time. See what I mean? It's a struggle. I should really make a separate video about this, shouldn't I? But yeah, you can kind of see the struggle I'm dealing with with Figment. You can see what's changed. Everything you saw just now is only the tip of the iceberg. And it doesn't even stop there. Because four seasons later, and we're up to season five. And all I can say is, Simba really let himself go. We're going to be playing as Hans next. Oops, I meant to say Scar. <laughs> Please help me. Ah, yes. My favorite. 
Scar versus Simba. But yeah, as you can see, new characters have been added and I am getting wrecked harder than anybody else in this game. I swear this game has gone from very forgiving to unforgiving overnight. And this is exactly why. <laughs> because with the Lion King having been dropped just recently, there's not much else I could say except we are going to die. Yeah, that's right. You better stay out of my way because Scar means business. And trust me when I say this, Scar isn't messing around. Wait, so I still got hit by that even though I'm invisible? What? <laughs> Let me get back out there. Oh, don't worry, Scar. You'll get your second chance. Just be patient. We've got two Scars, a Simba, and now a Nala. What is going on? Out of my way. <laughs> Scar is not messing around today. <laughs> so this Scar doppelganger thinks he can one-up me. <laughs> well, he's got another thing coming. <laughs> no. No, Donald. You need to sit oh, nuts. down. <laughs> We're in seventh again. This is going to be a regular thing now, isn't it? Ah! I flinched when I should have scurried. <laughs> Ah, uh, I missed. But I won't miss this time. Take this. I'm pretty sure that's not where I wanted that to land. If only. Oh, well. Scar can only do so much. I mean, he is a brand new character after all. Him, Simba, Nala, Mufasa. The works. I don't know. We're gonna play as Jafar now. Yeah, you can kind of tell where I'm going with this. They put villains in the game. After all, this game was initially advertised as a hero-based racer. But now, after hearing that statement, there should be an asterisk somewhere. Because with Jafar's inclusion, yeah, this sure looks like a hero-based racer. Ah, my steering wheel locked up again. Damn you, controller drift. So, as I mentioned before, Jafar is kind of where the whole villain thing started because with Aladdin being a thing in this game, it was only a matter of time. And I'll explain more about that later, but, you know, how can you be mad at this? I mean, it's Jafar. It's Jafar. <laughs> yes, try and get ahead of me if you can. On second thought, never mind. Seven isn't my lucky number right now. This isn't gonna end well, is it? Oh no, Figment is still following me. Why? Why must you do this to me? Why are you taunting me now? Well, we can quickly fix that. Yeah. Wow, that backfired successfully. Okay, so you know what really grinds my gears? And they're not really in the room right now. Ever since season four, I've had to deal with room upon room of nothing but Aladdins and Jasmines. Mostly Jasmines. And I think you can put the pieces together. Those of you who don't know... Uh, let's just say it has something to do with, uh, being mauled by a tiger, if you catch my drift. Uh, how dare you, Jesse? <laughs> what kind of world is this where Jafar, an all-powerful sorcerer, is getting his butt handed to him by a toy? I don't understand this. I don't understand. Hey, Jafar, what's your favorite song by Sonic Youth? We're gonna change gears a bit and go with Gantu. A little something different to cleanse the palate. I don't know. Okay, so you're gonna see why I don't like Jasmine in this game. And it's kind of obvious, as I, as I said before. Let's just say that Tiger... Yeah... It, you really don't want to mess with it or anything else for that matter. Uh, let's just say once you see it, it's going to hurt. Yeah, see that that right there. Back that up. That tiger right there. 
right there. That thing has been the bane of my existence since this game started, since Aladdin was announced back in season four. And now I'm really regretting my decision even playing this game because of that particular reason. I mean, the game is still good. I'm still playing it, but it's, I don't know. It's just, just something about Jasmine that rubs me the wrong way. And I think you could tell what it is. Okay, we're in third. We're actually doing pretty decent so far. Which is actually very surprising because I don't race as Gantu often. Now I know I need help. Yep, definitely gonna need some help for this one. Yeah, just gotta keep alternating is special. That's all it takes. I mean, as long as we're in third, we should be fine. We're making pretty good headway right now. For how long? I have no idea. Out of my way, Mike. Your time is over. Ah. Uh, ah. Uh, oh. Well, that backfired. Acceptable. Barely. I mean, it's the best I could do. Okay, that guy outsmarted me. But this next race, I won't let the next person outsmart me. Because I've got a plan. Yep, we're definitely going to die. There are two Jasmines in the room. Good luck, everyone. And That's easy for you to say. You don't know the turmoil I have to deal with. Take that. Great. We're in Arby's again. What? I'm sorry, what hit me? What is going on? The last thing that I wanted to do was go to Arby's. Hashtag not sponsored, by the way. I should have mentioned that in the previous video. <laughs> Please help. I am suffering here. I am getting lapped by everybody. Who thought Arby's was a good idea? Let me explain. I am so sorry I had to put you through that, Gantu. Really, I am. Please, God. Let Gaston be the one to take us to first today. Please. Okay, so far so good. Uh, yeah, nope, never mind. <laughs> I guess not. Ah. Yeah, so aside from Jafar, we also got villains like Gaston. <laughs> and I couldn't be happier. Because even though this game is labeled as a quote unquote hero based racer, Kinda sus if you think about it. There are, in fact, villains in this game. And I'm actually very curious to see who else they plan on putting in here as far as villains or whatever. Oh, how dare you, Hercules. That is not the same Hercules I had. Oh, come on. Why does my steering wheel have to lock up? <laughs> Damn you, controller drift. Out of my way. Out of my Mowgli. Out of my Mowgli, what? Man, I really, really need to think before I speak. <laughs> my brain is just running on autopilot right now. Out of my Mowgli. <laughs> as if, as if things couldn't get any weirder. <laughs> Honestly, this beats when I had to do off-road challenge and I said, this is the worst game in the track. <laughs> This is the worst game in the track. Worst game in the track. Worst game in the track. Welder, if you're watching this, I think you're the only one who knows about that and nobody else. <laughs> they all pay for this. I know, right? It's starting to get on my nerves. Oh, great. We got three Timones in the room. <laughs> How could this get any worse? <laughs> get out of my way. <laughs> Oh, how dare you, Mowgli. I had that right right in my sights, and you had to take it. Out of all the power-ups on the track you had to take, you had to take that one from me. How could you? Well, I mean, I'm doing a pretty decent job, but judging from the fact that we're still in seventh, that's not saying much. Apparently, things have gotten worse. I'm just not seeing it yet. Ah! This is more than I can bear. Well, I mean, it's not 7th, but okay. I mean, at least it's not 8th. 
Meh. This game is really starting to try my patience now. So let's change gears again and go with Randall this time. They'll never see me coming. That's what she said. Oh boy. Randall, I think you're facing your worst nightmare because not only do you have to face one, you got two Wazowskis to deal with. This isn't gonna end well, is it? Ah, uh, yeah, yeah, it happened again. <laughs> Game Loft, can we please fix this? I love finding bugs and glitches and all that, but I don't want to find them in every game. Also, why did I fly off the map? I thought that was only reserved for Splatoon, which I am going to be working on very soon. More about that later. But in all seriousness, I have, out of all of the Monsters, Inc. characters, I have been working with Randall the most recently like figment his special is a little more unique i would say because you kind of have to get up and cl up close and personal and ensure that you have that victory otherwise if you don't you're gonna suffer get out of my way jasmine this is not your time to shine so sit down uh where is first oh oh yeah that's that's fantastic i just saw who was in first Guess who? If you guess Jasmine, then correct. I swear it shouldn't have been Jafar Genie was cheering for. It actually should have gone, Jasmine, Jasmine, she's our man. If she can't do it, great! Well, that was better, I think. Not by a long shot, but I'll take it. I mean, this is Randall we're talking about here. Who else can do it better? Wait a minute, you forgot how the car works? How could you forget how the car works? What? <laughs> out of my way. Nope, not this time. Out of my way, Jasmine. Randall's taking first this time. Get out of my way. Not yet, Randall. You will soon enough, though. We just need to shake Goofy. Up we go. What the hell was that? Back that up for a second. I need to see what that was. Uh, Raja, you you feeling okay? You you look like you're clipping through the ground. Okay, doing good, doing good. Nope, not this time, Goofy. I just need one more. Thank you, Goofy. Now stay out of my way. Oh, I missed the rail big time. Not like it's gonna matter anyway. Okay, we're almost there. We just need to shake Goofy. I know that I know that it's Goofy that's behind me because he's got his shield up. You don't know how long I've waited for this. That's what I'm talking about. There's no help in this monster. You deserved that, Randall. Oh, this is so much fun. How do we top this? By playing as Hades, that's how. Bingo! And I'm looking forward to sharing him with all of you. <laughs> uh, this is definitely gonna end well. So, Hades is a bit of a, a, a wild card, I would say, as far as how he plays, because unlike all of the other characters, he plays a bit different. How different? Well... Hello, beast. Seriously, game, you're trying my patience. Out of my way, Simba. Come on, I dare you. Yeah, that's what I thought. Yep, I never thought that Hades would be the one to help us. I'm feeling pretty good. Let's do one more. I'm s- well, hang on, hang on a minute. Does that say stoned none? Huh, I didn't know- I didn't know nuns could get stoned. That's weird. Oh, 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 oh. Okay, okay. At least we're doing pretty good. So, uh, yeah, never mind. I take it back. Wait, aren't I supposed to use that if I'm behind a lot of people? Well, yep, I screwed up. Yep, I screwed up. Oh. Well, at least I didn't get wrecked. Uh, never mind. I got I got wrecked. Oh, I'll see you around. Uh, where did Elizabeth go? Oh, that's where she went. Uh, Relax. It's only half time. Yeah, you could say that again. I mean, at this point, I'm not really worried. Just look at that face and tell me otherwise. So yeah, that was Disney Speedstorm. Some old stuff, some new stuff, and honestly, not much has changed. If you count a couple of tweaks to the gameplay or whatever. 
I really hope you guys enjoyed because... Wait a minute. I'm forgetting something. There's one more thing I gotta do. And that's to show you this. Oswald. Oswald the Lucky Rabbit. I don't think the developers of this game realize how big this is. Having Oswald in a Disney game after how long since Epic Mickey or something like that. It's beyond me, but I don't, again, I don't think they realize how big this is. And before we end this video, we're just going to take the time to play through Oswald's event because it, I find that it's going to be easier than just unlocking him and then upgrading him. I don't want another figment situation. If you know what I mean. The only thing I feel like is going to be difficult about this is because we have a time trial to beat. That's our time. Keep that in mind. Oh boy, I love time trials. I especially love time trials that require you to beat your opponents by driving faster than them. But I'm feeling pretty confident about this. Okay, I'm actually lying. I'm not. Because I dread more than the spiny shell itself time trials. Especially in this game. Because... The time trials actually mean something here. And it can either mean life or death, depending on the character you're trying to work for. In this case, I really hope I do well. If not, then I got a lot of work to do. Come on. Oh, I just made it. I was kind of anticipating losing that one. But I'll take it. That's what I'm talking about. Because... If you noticed before, it was sitting at the top 25%, and I think I might have cracked the code. But we're gonna do one more, just in case. This one's for all the I was thinking the same thing! Oswald, you're reading my mind here! <laughs> Please stop, it's scaring me! Not this time! Oh, this could... This could spell certain doom for me. Oh, apparently not. Yeah, so Oswald. <laughs> I really wasn't expecting Oswald to ever be in this game. Like with Figment, like with, well, practically any of the mystery racers. With Disney Speedstorm, you have to expect the unexpected, you know? Because it's only a matter of time until some characters make it in that don't end up getting their own racetrack or whatever. I have no idea. I can't complain, honestly. I love this game too much to complain. I mean, I do have a list of complaints, but that's another story for another video. Anyway, well, we didn't quite get the time, but I think that's good enough. Actually, no, that's not good enough. So let's do one more and then I think we're done. I need to get ahead of these guys. Okay, we got to get a special going here. And luckily, we got one. Oh, we actually have two. That works for me. Thank you. Up we go. Ow. Oh. Bye then. Ah. Uh, ah. Uh, just staring at that time, it's really making me feel uneasy. This is it. Ah! Oh, you saw that, right? I was so close. I just needed, like, two seconds before that. Before the end of the race. I'm a little upset about that. Okay, I think that's enough Disney Speedstorm for one day. I want to thank you guys for watching. If you made it this far, just keep doing what you're doing, I guess. Supporting me and whatever else you need to do because <laughs> I can only tell you right now. It's only gonna get better from here on out I'm not entirely certain but you know I after after this I'm feeling pretty good <laughs> Now before I go I need to address a couple of things first of all the availability of this game in particular I made a comment at the end of the previous Disney Speedstorm video saying that this was a game that you had to spend money in order to play. That 
that statement also has an asterisk because now, instead of there being three founders packs, which was what I initially advertised before, now this game is entirely free to play. With the exception of in-game purchases and all that. But, you know, this game is way too fun to be angry with. So, <laughs> uh, pick up the game whenever you get a chance. It's free to play. Go ahead, download it whenever you get a chance. If if this game is your cup of tea or something like that. But, you know, it's, it's entirely up to you. I'm not trying to force this game on you. But it would really help the developers. It would help immensely. If you guys picked up this game and just gave the developers the support needed or whatever. I don't know. <laughs> okay, so that's that out of the way. Now comes the part of the video where I'm really dreading because it's update time for the channel <laughs> once again. So, first things first. The reason why you're seeing this video first and not another Splatoon video or another Mario Kart video, although Mario Kart is leagues done by now, is because, well, again, it's just because of my workload. I might as well put this video out before I work on the next series of Splatoon videos, which hopefully I should get done before the end of this year anyway. And if it happens, like, maybe around, like, next year or something then that's fine by me but the big thing is after this video i'm just gonna get right to the point do what i should have done day one with splatoon and everything else stop talking and just play and that brings me to the final item on the list once again i don't know how many times i need to say this but thank you guys so much for sticking with me since i don't know the, the Mario Kart stuff since the beginning of Spl my Splatoon series, since the first Disney Speedstorm video, just up until this point, up until now. I cannot thank you guys enough, but I have a feeling my job is not done yet. Because from what I've been watching as far as like my goals and all that, I've been fluctuating between three subscribers sitting at 380. So if you guys would do me a huge favor, I want to make it perfectly clear before the end of 2023, we make it to 400. If not, then we have a lot of work to do next year. But again, I can't thank you guys enough. I, I love you guys. I love your support. I love your feedback, everything else. The fact that you guys make my day even brighter matters to me. The fact that you guys are sticking with me, all 380 of you, that matters to me. Here's to next year. Here's to 400 subs, I hope. And hopefully things get better, you know? I'm really trying here. And that's all that matters. And I think that's it. There's not much else to say, except, yeah, Disney Speedstorm. It gets better every season, but I could seriously do without the microtransactions. Seriously, I've only had to spend for tokens once in this game. Something I did not want to end up doing, but I did it anyway. And that's not even the, the main problem with this game. More on that later. Bye!